Hey guys, what is up and I welcome each and every one of you to a new episode of my journey to masters in this one We're sitting at diamond one 57 LP the previous episode. We went one and one We lost the first game. We won the second game I believe and I think we actually ended up getting a little bit more LP than we initially started with by like maybe two or three Which I mean, you know every little victory counts I guess either way we'll be going towards you know the master promos for this episode time is running out So we have to start playing a little bit more a little bit more I guess you know seriously and just trying really just you know mm, trying for that final push man because we're we're so close and again I've never been masters before it's it's kind of sad honestly but you know we're going for masters we're close we're close we're there so with all that being said and done let's just queue up let's play some League of Legends let's get closer and closer to that master promo I guess so the first game is about to begin well I mean it technically has begun but we're playing Twisted Fates now I was actually first pick and uh we have the Adrian Riven guy right who plays a lot of Riven on our team and I asked him if he was going Riven he said yes and I don't want to first pick Zed when I already know our top laner is going Riven so you know it, it's it, you're pretty much asking for them just to pick like a really tanky lineup and just you know getting just completely wrecked off of that so I don't want to risk it so ended up pulling out the TF I feel like you know kind of switching it up here and there is good and TF is going to be pretty much my main um, AP champion for the mid lane because you know you do need an AP counterpart uh, for the sake of you know situations like this so either way playing TF for this game so let's go let's do it man let's win First. Damn, I mean, he still got first blood while getting ganked. That's pretty good. I'm gonna see if I can run top. Holy shit, this nearly straight popping off. I don't know if that was super worth. Like, if she played that a little bit slower, I would have just came there and I would have, I would have dove and we got the kill, and she would have lived as well. Jesus, kill her ass already, please. Grand is coming. Okay, a Durban actually might be able to get away. The Oriana does have flash. Ooh, okay, the style points on that, I like it. God damn it, dude. I I'm actually surprised. The GPL kind of kind of destroyed me though. I did a lot of damage. Come on, kill him, please kill him. One more. Oh, beautiful. No, we can't. We got to back. They can get that dragon. That's a fire dragon. That's nice to have. I'm honest. I'm actually pretty surprised my Q hit there. I guess I, this rocket sounds. I was going to flash and uh, what's it called? The gold card and then, you know, obviously keep this rock and kill her. But the silence is just destroying me right now, man. It's kind of, it's really fucking like, messing me up. It's, it's really, really annoying. So that became kind of awkward, but luckily I ended up sniping the Q and I ended up getting her. I had to flash out though, because I TP'd into the back line, so I was by myself for like two seconds. And that was a lot of time for them to just wail away at me, especially with the Soraka route. I mean, th that's a two for one. That's not even that good. Like, considering that that top lane is going to get pushed in really hard here, like, that's honestly not even that amazing. Like, I can't even defend this by myself. Like, sure, they can get that power, I hope, but I cannot defend this by myself. Like, I just cannot. Yeah, it's gone. I just did that to give them full vision so the Riven knows exactly where they are so she knows exactly how long she has 
to like push it in. Riven is wasting a lot of their time though, so we can hopefully get a lot of objectives off of this. There we go, dragon. I'm very, very close. Actually, I have this. I have Lich Bane. I, I don't have time to back to get it, unfortunately, but that should be fine. I have a lot of gold. I want to back. Oh, God. He should, he should be fine, right? Like, he's so tanky. Yeah, he's fine. Okay, so now I have a lot of gold, right? I have the Lich Bane. I have my... um. The CDR kicking in, and once I get my Zhonya's, I'll have essentially the 40% CDR, right? Because I have 10% scaling, 10% from this, 10% from this, and then 10% from Zhonya's. It's 40%, and I really like a lot of CDR on TF, like, really early, because I feel like he's just, he's so CDR dependent. You want to be throwing out those gold cards, and just those cards in general, like, as often as possible, on top of also using your ult as often as possible. Those are just the two things you really want on this champion. I have a lot of mystery. Dude, they were actually doing Baron? Like, what kind of desperate attempt was that? Holy shit. I'm, I'm, kind of, I'm really surprised that they got away with it, too. I really did not think they were doing it. That's really surprising. But we can get a lot off of this. This is why you gotta reset, man, and not do these like really greedy plays and like staying around for just too long for no reason. Really no reason at all. Oh shit, that's bad. God. My death at the inhibitor was so bad. My one mistake this game, like one, my one big mistake, and it was a fatal one too. It was such a bad mistake. Like that one death I did at the inhibitor was massive. Like that was such a bad death. Like that was actually ridiculously bad. All right guys, so the next game is about to begin. Uh, I'm still a little disappointed about the previous loss, but putting it behind us, uh, playing Talon in the mid lane. Now my Zed actually got taken. I wanted to go Zed this game, but unluckily, Unlucky, rather. Someone ended up picking him uh, right before me, so... Wait, the Malphite has Warlord's Bloodlust. What the hell? That doesn't seem like it's correct. Oh. Oh. I know you want to flash pull that ass. Uh, you waited too long. Okay. Let me just, well, you know, just quickly grab that, you know, no biggie, no biggie, and then we're just gonna piece the hell out. I'm just gonna back in this bush really quickly. I hope they don't mind. Now, yeah, Malphite has Whirlers. Uh, what the hell is that Zed doing is my question. Is that no flash? I don't think he understands my damage, does he? Some talent boy? With Ignite, I do a lot of damage, especially if you give me a melee Q like that to proc my passive. Like, I do a lot of damage, man. You gotta respect that. Oh. 
A little bit unlucky there, but they almost got the kill. Damn, that's so unlucky. He was so close to dying. Malphite no flash now, though. That's really good. That bleed damage with a few minion auto attacks that were flying at it was just barely enough. Mike, what what are they doing, honestly? What the hell are they doing? Wait, he's, he's trolling, like he gave up. He just doesn't even care anymore. Wait, so is that actually just flat out backing? But why? Okay, he should be back right now. Man, like I, I don't, I don't, I don't understand what's going on. I feel like this game is just a troll. It's like a troll fest, man. Like, just why? Like, what the hell's going on? I'm just running around getting kills left and right. Um, this doesn't feel like. Is that no arm? Is that no arm? Don't be scared. Okay, I guess I'll take that kill too. Push in the mid lane wave here, and then I'm gonna back. I mean, I'm seven to no. I have seventy farm at eight minutes. Like I'm farming decently well, and I have almost a kill a minute. Like that's that's when you know you're kind of dead. Wait, what the? F the Malpha was sitting in that bush. They were just waiting. I don't think they were gonna do that. I thought, I don't know what I thought actually. I thought they were doing Herald, but I, it's not even ten minutes into the game yet. Wait a minute. Where is the Zed, dude? I want a revenge kill after that. Like, I'm actually kind of pissed after that kill. Like, for them to just sit in the bush and kill me like that? Like, what the hell? Come on, bro. Fuck! I actually died, dude. Damn, I didn't, even, I didn't even get the kill. Is that Ignite though? I'm actually kind of surprised. Like, honestly, that was a little bit ham. Like, what I could have done is I could have just like messed around with the Jax in his jungle, but instead we went for like a super ham play like that, which just did not work. I don't think he can catch him. Maybe. Maybe. He has the EQ right here. Right now. The Karma's actually catching up on CS. Again, at the end of the day though, this Malphite is going some like, I don't even know what the hell he's building. He has an Aether Wisp on Malphite. Like, what is he doing with him? Dude, I'm getting tilted. I'm actually getting tilted. I'm, I'm like, we're throwing. We're getting so desperate. We're trying to like extend our lead, and I don't know why I followed that up. I didn't see what happened to Ezreal, but like, what happened to Ezreal? Actually, legit, I didn't even see what happened to him. But like, like oh, this is actually starting to piss me off. I'm actually starting to get mad. All right, all right. Yeah, why are we diving? Like, why are we doing these? Okay, why am I? Why am I doing these stupid plays? Dude, we need the Herald, boys. We need the Herald, man. Oh. Cool. Keep pushing this in, boys. Let's go. We can see we can stop all this lead, man. Because these throws are starting to scare me. There's two dead. There's no way they can stop this. Like, there's literally no way. Like, the Malphite is pretty much... Malphite is pretty much trolling at this point. Like, this game is... That was actually pretty nice. We should be able to get an inhib here, I believe. I have red buffs, so I am regenerating quite a decent amount. Well, I mean, assuming I'm out of combat, I believe. Right, it's out of combat only, right? Just 
please this time actually just back like legitimately just press back just go away man just run away from whatever you're trying to do there because that is there all you have to do is force the baron or we can go bot and push like i have a lot of gold Thank God. See, the only reason like I would even go that deep is because I do have the uh, the GA, right? So like if I die, that's fine. Because you saw three of them were on top of me just huddling around just waiting for me to respawn. But like why does that, you know, like it doesn't matter. Because like while they're all just standing there watching me respawn for like the second and a half or two seconds it takes, I'm just busy like my team is just busy killing the fuck. It's not much legit troll, like he's actually just full AP off like this. Jesus. Yo, just finish this game, dude. People are so troll. Like, they're so troll. Just finish the game. All right, guys, so that's gonna be it for this episode. Sitting at Diamond 154 LP, unfortunately, we're literally just a couple of LP lower than what we started, only because I uh, I dodged one game, right? I did dodge one game, so I believe we are three LP lower than what we started. I think I'm, I'm assuming I started at 57, right? Four plus threes. 4 plus 3 7 right um and so a, a little bit unfortunate you know a little bit uh behind to uh as to where we started but I'm, I'm playing only two games per episode at the very moment because i'm trying to kind of i'm trying to what's the word i'm trying to pace myself if you will you know i'm trying to be like more methodical about how i play but don't worry guys like again you know if people are wondering oh man you're only playing like two games every like few days like that's not that's not enough you know I am practicing a lot on this account, right? It's currently D2, 32 LP, you know, we're looking pretty good. I'm practicing a lot, you know, doing a lot of things, you know, playing that talent, practicing them and whatnot. So I'm not just sitting around, you know, doing nothing. I am practicing, I am, you know, obviously always getting ready, warming up, I guess, if you will. But I am in turn gonna try to release a Journey to Masters about every other video or so, every every other video or every two videos. So it'll be like a Journey to Masters, another video, Journey to Masters, or Journey to Masters, two videos, Journey to Masters, one video, Journey to Masters, two videos. It'll be like that because this is essentially the last month to grind it. So I will be releasing more um, uh, episodes and whatnot. And so hopefully you guys are excited for that. And I mean, if you guys are excited for more Journey to Masters, because this is the way to bring it, then boom, hit it with that like button. If you're excited for the, uh, the climb to Masters, because it is still getting close, unfortunately for me, we're just so close to the promos like we just need like two two or three wins to get into promos and that's all like just that's that's it just one episode where i just pop off and just win two or three games in a row boom in the promos and that's gonna be like, so so close all i need is actually one more win and i'm the closest i've ever been to masters uh this season which is pretty hype as well but either way guys thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed the video boom hit it with that like button if you're excited hit it with that like button as well and maybe you know for every like is an extra chance for me to get masters please help me but i thank you guys for watching and i'll see you for the next one